Let's talk about a few signs that you are dating a promiscuous woman. Now, who's a promiscuous woman? A promiscuous woman in Nigeria pigeon is an Ashawa woman. Okay, you're dating a woman who wants to have multiple partners. You're dating a woman who wants to sleep around. You know, all of that. That's what being a promiscuous woman is now there are a few ways to know that this woman is a promiscuous woman and you need to be very careful because on here i tell you the type of women you shouldn't date so if the woman you are with is showing any of these signs i'm going to be mentioning then that's a sign that she's a promiscuous woman who is just hiding in the shadows and if you let her she might do you dirty so make sure you watch the video until the end to know signs that this girl might be a promiscuous woman aka an a shower woman so let's talk about this so hey guys welcome to my channel welcome back to my channel this is real talk with ij and i am ij guys if you're not yet following me on instagram make sure you go follow me the link is going to be in the description box make sure you go click on that link and follow me and i will follow you back so that i can put a face to your names here on insta on youtube all right so let's talk about the signs that a woman is promiscuous all right and the very first one is she admits to cheating but she blames her ex yes she tells you oh my ex was always cheating on me so i cheated back really seriously are you serious okay now some of us have been there honestly and it could just be youthful exuberance it could just be that you just did it because you were hot and you wanted to hurt this person back but if it's a routine if she keeps telling you like that's what happened with all of her relationship like are you very sure it was the ex that cheated that made her to cheat plus Cheating back is not a way of resolving someone that is cheating or resolved already. I don't know how to put it, but like that's not the best way to pay back a partner who hurts you. The best way is to walk away because you deserve better. So if you're dating a girl who tells you when a man cheats, I will cheat also. When he's cheating, I will cheat also. Everybody can cheat. Who can play the game? She's just being promiscuous. That woman will sleep with anybody. Yes. Yeah, in fact, she will not even have to wait for her her partner to cheat she might just cheat because she's already good at it she's already good at jumping into another man's bed because the one she's with is hurting her or he's driving he's doing something that annoys her or he's seeing somebody else so rather than breaking up with him she's you know jumping into bed with somebody else so if you're dating a woman who is okay with telling you yes i cheated because he cheated then walk away if you're dating a woman who keeps telling you she's having she had her last relationship was it was two weeks and they broke up, three weeks and they broke up, one month. Like my longest relationship is only one month and she has dated like 20 people already, but in two, two weeks. I don't understand why you should want to be dating somebody like that who has a very poor choice at picking the kind of man she wants to be with. If a woman is not smart enough to know the kind of man that she wants to be with, there's a chance that she might be promiscuous. She's just jumping into bed with any and everybody and calling all of them a mistake. He was not nice. He was this. She has a poor choice at men. And she's always having very short-term relationships. And there are people always just sleeping with her. Sleeping with her and dumping her every two weeks. Sleeping with her and dumping her every two weeks. Because she's not smart enough to know the kind of men that she should be dating or smart enough to understand or make herself a high-value woman then I don't think you should be dating somebody like that. There's a chance that she could be promiscuous and she just enjoys, you know, being with different men at different times because the right thing to do when you know that you're always dating wrong people is to give yourself a break at dating. You should stop dating, think about yourself, grow, heal before you jump back into the dating world. But if you're dating every AK market day, every two days you're dating somebody, then be careful. She might just be promiscuous. The third way to know that a woman is being promiscuous is if she's always having one night stand so let's say maybe you met her through a one night, one night stand and now you want to make her your girlfriend because she was really good at what you guys did are you serious how many one night stands do you think she has had if you're just meeting a girl for the first time and you guys are having sex immediately and you're thinking she's good i need to keep her how many people do you think she has had that one night stand with how many people do you think she has had sex on the first date with you think it's only you you think it's because you're special think about it so you want to make a girl your lifetime partner after having a one night stand with her and you tell her marry me are you serious i should be asking you again are you very serious it's a sign that that woman might be an ashawa and you don't want to date a woman who is okay with sleeping with anybody the first day that she's meeting them now we're not judging anybody it's okay to live your life and have fun let god judge but the thing is do you want to make that person your wife if you're my brother i would say no i'm sorry but yes i would say no because we don't know how many more men that she has slept with on the first date or you know had a one night stand with so if she if she just meets you for the first time and she's okay with getting down with you 
she might just be a promiscuous woman now this one is very very interesting if you're dating a girl who is always wanting to be slutty or look slutty and it's okay if your woman wants to be slutty with you in the bedroom like when you guys are in the house she wants to you know be revealing do all the slutty things that's what's actually fine but if she's doing it to get attention from men then there's a problem okay if a girl has been slutty because she wants men to see her she wants men to feel her maybe you guys are going out to the club or you guys are just going out so she wants to wear all sort of revealing clothes because she wants all eyes on me and she you know she's very conscious of the men around her and she's looking at men straight in their eyes trying to get their attention to her because she's being slutty then that's a huge sign that's a huge sign that she might be a promiscuous woman if she's slutty on purpose and she's doing it to get attention of men it's something that you should really watch out for and if your woman is exhibiting this you need to call her and tell her i don't like what you're doing like you can't be dressed like this in front of other men or you can't be you know dressed like this on social media because you're trying to get men's attention and you want men to validate you and all of that it could be that she's really trying to get the attention for a purpose and not just because i mean she just wants to be slutty like who really wants to just be slutty when you're not a porn star like i don't know another point is she is comfortable flirting with every man if she's flirting with every man and she doesn't even care that you're there especially if you're there she's on her phone she's calling people sweetheart darling my love my baby i miss you i love you and she's telling you know this is just me i'm just being nice this is how i'm nice with everybody she's giving everybody hugs and rubbing boobs in their chest like are you serious are you serious there's no boundary there's nothing in that relationship she's okay with you know calling people pet names when you're there or when you are her relationship but she's okay with flirting with people and she's telling you no come on it's innocent flirt now he's just my friend that's how we call each other baby like i call him baby that's just how we do it run no she's being promiscuous so there's a, there's a very high probability that she could cheat that kind of woman would probably cheat on you so don't put yourself in such position just be very careful and last but not the least is if she's always hiding her phone like seriously she's hiding her phone she doesn't want you to see her chat she's reading and deleting the chats she's reading and deleting the chats like she's always hiding her phone she has passwords everywhere in her phone like what do you want me to tell you yes that one is actually very very self-explanatory if a woman is always hiding her phone and she doesn't want you to see who she's chatting with or who she's talking with and she's always deleting chats Maybe she will say, I don't want you to hurt you. It's just a natural, a normal chat, but I don't want you to feel bad that I was chatting with this person. Like, why are you even doing it? If you know I'm going to feel bad as a man, why are you even doing it? That's the question. So, if a woman's always hiding her phone, it could be because she's a promiscuous woman and she doesn't want you to catch her in the act. So, that's the end of the video for today. I hope you found it educative as well as entertaining. Guys, make sure you check out my next video because it promises to be really, really educative as well as entertaining. And make sure to like this video, share, and subscribe if you're not already subscribed. Click on that bell notification so that you don't miss out on any of my videos. And once again, don't forget to follow me on Instagram, guys. I look forward to meeting you guys there and, you know, having a more personal conversation with you all. And I have a YouTube membership. If you want to have a one-on-one -on -one coaching section with me or you just want to appreciate me for the work I'm doing, make sure you click in the link. It's going to be in the description box and, you know, join my membership and we can get to, you know, we can get personal and, you know, I can see how I can help your relationship become better. So until next time, keep living life, keep being champs and bye for now. Mwah.